Hello creators, welcome to my channel, as I know this is my first tutorial video, and today we are creating any 2D logos into 3D using Illustrator and Cinema 4D, don't worry it's easy, first, take any logo, I am downloading it from Google. Open it in Illustrator. Adjust size. Now go to the window and search for the image trace option. Adjust your trace according to your logo. In my case low fidelity photo is good. Once it has done, now go to the object tab and under the image trace click for expand D option. What it does is, it separates every individual of the layers from the image, so we can delete unwanted parts from it. In some case, you have to minus the unwanted layer with our current layer using the Pathfinder tools under the Window tab. Yeah. Select the unwanted layer with our expanded layer, with the Pathfinder tool, click the minus option. Same with another layers and align the position. Now save it using the Illustrator 8 option like this. Now open Cinema 4D, go to Open Project, search Illustrator file, that we saved just now, and open it. Leave the default setting. It will open as a path, we have to extrude it using the Extrude tool. Go to Extrude, place our path under it, as you see there is no effect taken because our path is in separate parts, we have to mesh it. To do it select all the parts of our path and click the Connect Object plus Delete option. Now it's done but the depth of the extrude is high in number, you can adjust it just by going movement option in extrude and decrease the value. Our logo is ready, but as you see the edges of our 3D logo, is rough you can smooth it, using volume builder and volume mesh. Just go to volume builder, put our logo under it, now you can see our logo like a glitch, cause we have to adjust the, voxel size. Just go for it. For me 0.03 is good. Now finally we have to put it under volume mesh to make it more smooth. Adjust the voxel threshold, and the job is done. Your 3D logo is ready, this is how you can convert any 2D logo into 3D using, Illustrator, and Cinema 4D. Now you can put any material, in it, or animate it, using many more tools in Cinema 4D. Thanks for watching. Have a good day.